Uh, I would just like uh, if I could just stay in the uh, yeah and maybe work some cut the thing. I'm Roy. I teach band in Texas. So I'm excited to play and conduct. Yeah. Okay. Uh, if we can go back and uh, work on some stuff at the beginning, color, uh, flute at measure four. You can you can just be as rich and as velvety as you can. Um, clarinet before that at two. You'll just just like it says white tone. Okay, and then uh, any time after that we have the arpeggios. You can just bring those just fill from the bottom. Um, very strong. If we could start, let's just start the. No, I, I just, I didn't want any, I mentioned her and I didn't want to, I guess I really shouldn't have mentioned him. Okay. <laughs> it was a waste of time. I, I apologize. I think he thinks you want to change and I bet he's baffled because that No, it was, or, it was, it was gorgeous. This, I mean. Or you, you said, you said at two. Yeah, measure oh, two, sorry. Measure two. Okay, measure yeah. two. Sorry. All right. We start at one, um, but soon at ten. If you could just 
He's just right above everything else. He's kind of peeked through. Yeah, that means more, not more. Yes. Is that right? Yeah. Okay. One. here if we could um, all the uh, are the quarter notes if we could bring those out and lessen the, the longer notes and cello if you could bring your part out because everything you have is four so just lean in on that and then violin and flute just soar above it right here at two I'm, I'm sorry I'm really not trying to pick on you but I'm confused because the last part you said I thought you said long notes stay out of the way and then at the end you said violin and flute soar above it and they're the only long notes and okay. you told the quarter notes to be louder too therefore everything is louder is that what you want? I want their long notes to be, uh, the flute and violin to be louder. Who else has long notes? Um, the, whenever they get off the. Once they get to the. Yes, yeah, so oh, once they okay. get to long. Sorry. I got you. I'll, more specific. Here you go, two. Yes, sir. But I don't know anything about the articulation qualities that you want. Okay. Do you mean describe it or demonstrate or just show? It? Show it. Okay. Do you um, do three before four. Yes. Two or in four? I would I would have stayed, but okay. same spot. Again, they knew when to play but not how. There's no information about the RT okay. okay, now you're thinking if that's what you want. Right. Oh, okay. okay. I think it will be in the long term. Yeah. But I think you, you're, the best moments for you are the moments where you're conducting the least and you're listening the best. Okay. When you're listening the best, you do things that are organic and in sync with the music and with what's going on in everybody else in the room. Okay. And it just makes sense. Mm -hmm. And then when you try to demonstrate some specific thing, it usually seems to take you out of that space. So in other words, with you, it seems like we have to choose active conducting or listening. Okay. And the art is getting both. Right. That's right. the art. And it's the hardest thing in the world to do unless you're really confident and really comfortable. And there's a million reasons that it might not go that way right. on any particular day wherever you are. But that would be my wish for you. Okay. For right now, you've got about 80-20. You're about 80 active conducting, 20% listening. Could you flip it for a little while? Okay. Be like 80% listening, 20% conducting. Okay. Make sense? Mm-hmm. Okay. Thank Where'd you. you? Oh. 
Sorry, just time. Oh, yeah. Thank you. Thank you, guys. Thank you.